Welcome aboard my brand new vlog series. I'm so glad to have you here. My family and I spent the most incredible week aboard P&O Cruises Iona on a tour of the Norwegian fjords. Iona is pretty wowy with 14 restaurants, 19 bars and cafes, theatre, cinema, library, whirlpools, infinity pool, hydrotherapy pool, the sky dome, its own gin distillery, fantastic kids club, huge spa and extremely comfortable cabins. This ship is something special. I hope these vlogs give you a good taste of what a cruise is like. It was our first ever cruise and we were blown away by it. I can't wait to show you the ship, the food, the excursions and just a bit of happy mum life with two little girls. If you have any questions at all, leave them below. But until then, give this video a thumbs up and enjoy the vlog. Good morning to you from a rather misty but very beautiful Olden. This is the second stop on our Norway cruise um, with P&O Cruises on Iona. Um, and we have a really, really lovely day planned today. So I thought I would take you with me, show you everything that we get up to. Uh, but first, let's take in the view just a little bit more. So we can see land popping out over the top of those clouds and that mist. And then all these little houses nestled on the hillside all the way over here. So I've come into Liam's room and Liam got pearl dressed in this top and I'm wearing like the matching adults top and we didn't even plan it today did we? We just got lucky that we're matching. So I've sent Darcy back because she's got this top as well so I sent her back so we can all be Stripy matching together, can't we? And Daddy has got stripy well, top. Well, Daddy's not super matching, but he's blue. Let's see who this is. It's Darcy and she's matching too. Yeah. Come on in. We're like... With me. We're like triplets today. Do you think yeah. people will mistake us for triplets? Yeah. Do you think people will think I'm your sister, Pearl? No. Who will they think I am? Your mum. What do you think, Pearly? Um, your um, our mum, because... Darcy is matching with me. Yeah, okay. No, no, because you got black, 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 black. Well, navy, 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 but yes. Should we go and have a look at the top deck and see the view? Yeah. That's what you want to do, isn't it, babe? Yeah, let's go. It's just about to go, and Liam said. Let's put this jumper on. <laughs> I can't decide if we're going to look really cool or... No. <laughs> really not cool. You decide in the comments or maybe don't. I'm here for it. I like it. We've come up to deck 18 for the panorama deck. I don't think I've been up here yet. It's basically. Wow, this is lovely. My favourite though. Yeah. This is just on the map. There's snow on a mountain. So there's snow up there. Yeah, yeah, there is. It's like, oh, here's some chest, but there's a mountain. There's some chest, but there's a mountain. <laughs> the queen. Yeah, you know that one, don't you? Fun fact for you, if you do seven laps, you've walked a mile of this deck. It's pretty impressive. <laughs> Not just him. <laughs> hey, look, there's the top of the Sky Dome where we were last night. That's in um, the previous vlog, which I'll link below for you. And that's the top of that. Imagine having gotten up early and being in this pool and looking at that view. Wow. We've taken in the views, done a few photos. Now we are going to head for breakfast. Where are you thinking for breakfast, babe? I'm going to go on the loop first. Oh, we're going to do a whole loop. Just walking past the children's splash pad zone. Have a little splash and admire a Norwegian fjord. Can't get over it. Just come down to the sixth floor to go to the Pearl restaurant. And I just wanted to show you that they have their own gin distillery on board. If you're into gin, that's pretty cool. Oh, I've lost them now. Oh, no, I thought I'd lost them, but I haven't. They're just having a look at the cinema. So cash. Turning red. Um, don't you want to go out and explore? So much to do, it's hard to choose, isn't it? This is Anderson's Bar and Library. I'm just doing a little tour whilst things are empty. That looks lovely in there. It's obviously shut because it's only 
8.30, a bit early for a drink. So this is the Pearl restaurant. Here's the milk. There you go. You're welcome. You're going to give it a little stir. Oh, lovely. So refined, Pearly. I've for poached eggs with hash browns and beans. Are you ready for the poached egg? Oh, yes. That was a good poached egg. So since we have um, an excursion booked this afternoon, we are going to enjoy the ship for a little while. I'm really hankering for hot chocolate. Um, and what else? We think maybe going to the cinema. But right now, we're just in here and it's lovely. I love this slower pace of things. It's really nice. Thank you so much, Pearly. That, that's from Darcy. That's from Darcy. I love it so much. Pearly? <laughs> have you been using felt tips? How do I, how can I tell? <laughs> it's all over your jumper. We haven't even been out yet. She's covered. <laughs> so we have disembarked Iona. And look at this view. I feel like I've, all I've done today is say look at this view, but look at it. <laughs> what else is there to say other than look at this view? I'm going to call this video look at this view. <laughs> Darcy wants to tell you something. I'm pretty sure that over there is ice, so like you can see the water moving. Yeah. And over there it's just sort of still. Hmm, I don't I don't know that it is ice. But, but it, might, it looks like ice though, doesn't it? It looks like ice. Looks like ice. We've popped into a little gift shop right by the ship. I'm sorry, but how cute are these? I really love oh, those. I like the Oh, you think that's cute, do you? <laughs> oh! Hello, she's a magnet. Wow, what can't she do? Oh my goodness, we all remember mood rings, but do you remember moose mood rings? Oh my goodness, this is exactly the sort of thing I would have bought as a kid on holiday. That's the reaction I would have had, but like a gigantic pencil. I remember once I got one from Italy, I think, and I was so happy with my giant pencil. <laughs> Does anyone else remember that we are off on our excursion? We are going on a cable car. It is absolutely gorgeous up here. It's like being in a fairy tale. I'm gonna get some shots and do like zoom in a bit. Um, it's quite windy. I'm hoping my little sound muffler is helping. Um, but if not, I'll just put some music over and let you enjoy these beautiful sights. Trotted down it, we're like. It's meant to go quickly. Well, it's quite steep. I know. Ready? No, don't run. Do not run. Do not run. <laughs> Liam's just gone down, no problem, holding Pearl in one arm, and we're like, hey. Here we go. Nice and slow. Nice and slow at the side of the mountain. <sighs> so we were down at that viewing platform, and we are coming up to this one now, but. This is a bit steep, but at least it's not gravel, so you can get a bit of grip on it. I don't feel like like a little mountain goat that's going to slip down the side. Thank God for Liam. Look at him. Peak of physical fitness. Just like me. The ox 
it's Jen's dinner at pay, that's what it will be. Whew. Not near the edge, sweetie. So at the top, they have that just there. You can see the glacier over there. There's a little pond kind of thing over here. And then the Skyless Station and Cafe just there. Oh look, if you look, can you see Iona? Just boop in there. So part of the excursion is that we get to come in here, this lovely restaurant, for coffee and cake. Thank you much. Look, are you going to dig in then? How many cakes do we miss? Thank two, you. Right? Just two. Thank oh, you. Yeah. Oh, that looks so nice. Oh, thank you. Here it comes. We're going to get on this one to go down. Here we go. <laughs> In a minute, Pearly Fox. Oh, speed up in a minute. Are you ready? Are you excited? Yeah? Oh, wow. Oh, my goodness. Oh, oh, my goodness. The doctor mean it was good to bring them up uh, to the mountain, but he uh, not uh, think so much about the road up to the mountain. Uh, if you want to visit us later, you are welcome. So since we could see the ship from the cable car station, we should be able to see the cable. We can look. If I zoom in, hang on, let me do a big zoom. Oh, I don't know if this is in focus or not, but right up there, that's where we just were. Nazi. Somebody's getting ready right man for what are you getting ready for? Nice. Yeah. So this is my parent trap inspired outfit. It's gorgeous. Yeah. You look fabulous. Thank you. Like mother, like daughter, I have also uh, decided to dress up this evening. Here's my here's my hot date for the night. The thing I'm most thrilled about is not the going out, but the fact that I can actually, or where I get the shoes on tonight. I wanted to wear these for formal night, uh, but basically one foot of mine swol swelled up, just one. The other one was fine. The other one was like a little little puff ball, wasn't it? It was it was quite a look. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Liam's like, I'm not gonna say anything and get myself into trouble over this. Um, so I could have had one high heel and one flip-flop, but that would have looked even weirder. So I had to go flip-flops, but today my feet are normal, so I'm feeling a little bit glam. There we go. And then this bag here, um, I've not worn before, but I've had a while, is from Accessorize. Um, and yeah, I'm just feeling a bit snazzy. Oh, look, like a little lift selfie. I should have probably said that the girls are in Kids Club and we are going to, oh good, no, it's in here. We're going to the Limelight Lounge. We're gonna have dinner going and watch a show. It's Matt Terry performing. It's almost closing. Yeah, um, so we're going to go and do that. We're looking forward to like a bit of a onboard date night, aren't we? Yeah. I'm going to stop vlogging now because the doors will open and everyone will see it very embarrassing. So this is the Limelight Club. Everyone sat at little tables with little candles. This is the menu if you want to pause the screen and have a quick look. I think I'm going to go for the vegetarian options. So the glazed king oyster mushroom scallops. Shall I guess what you're going to go for, babe? Yeah. I think you're going to go for the salmon to start. No. Okay, the ham hock to start. No. Okay, the vegetarian scallops to yes. start. Yes, love scallops. What? They're, they're, they're vegetarian scallops. Oh. It's changed your mind then, hasn't I'm it? I like the salmon. Yeah, there we go. And I think for main, you're going to go obviously for the beef. No. Oh my god, okay, do I even know you at all? The sea bass. No. Wow, this is embarrassing. Is it the lamb rat? It is, it's because we don't have it that often, so you wouldn't know. <laughs> okay, I don't even know if I want to guess your dessert, but I'm going to say that you're going to go for the strudel. Yes. Okay, thank God. <laughs> Our cocktails have come. I'm having a cosmopolitan. You're having a lemon. 
a lemon drizzle spritz and these are our amuse bouches and it's um, an aubergine pate it looks lovely sorry for this horrible angle but if I tip up then you get all the people behind me um, staff here are so nice the menu here is two um, two meat course two meat options and one vegetarian I didn't really like anything on the menu here so I'm such a fussy eater and I don't really eat most meat yard yard anyway they said that they would bring me a meal from the other restaurant which is just so nice ladies and gentlemen this is a big moment Liam's taking a photo now if you know Liam Liam takes about 14 photos a year you take no photos, do you? Like zero photos. I think I've got about the same amount of photos in the last 12 years than you have in the last 12 days. <laughs> Why do you take so few photos? It's because I take them all, isn't it? <laughs> but he took a photo of his meal, so that was a big moment. Well done, the meal. Oh my God, it's happening again. He's doing it again. He's taken about three pictures of me on this trip and two of food. I love food. I love eating. I'm not offended, the food does look good. Dessert has arrived and if I'm quite honest with you, I've forgotten what it is, but I know it is strudel of some sort. Oh my god, I don't know what magical ingredients are in this strudel. I'll be honest, when I looked at it, I thought, I'm not sure, but what they're putting here is like fairy dust and unicorn tears because it's more cheers to you. Liam's back, I'm going to talk to one of our friends. There he is. So we finished our dessert, and there's no one performing at the moment, and we're counting up how many photos we've taken today, and Liam said he's taken a lot. I have taken, right, how many have you taken? 106. Which although, is more than you would say, take in a year. Although I would say the children have taken most of those. Oh yeah, because they play on your phone a lot. Guess how many I've taken today, hang on. I reckon... Hang on, wait for them to see, right. You in the video can see how many you think I've taken. I, I think you've taken 600. Very close. 560 in one day. Also, for goodness sake, that's, how many photos do you guys have on your uh, I think that's camera my rolls? <laughs> Thanks for that. Us doing a yawn. Thank you so much. <laughs> Limelight Club and Matt Terry and the food and the atmosphere and the drinks were amazing. I've left a little bit early. <sighs> I've left a little bit early because I suddenly just felt really worried about the girls. I don't know why. <laughs> I get like this sometimes. Um, Liam's just enjoying the rest of it. I really did enjoy it. I thought it was amazing. But something in me was just like, go and get the girls. So I think there's only about 15 minutes le left anyway. So I'm going to go and get the girlies and see how they are. Do you have the best time? Oh, you're a walrus. Okie dokie. Did you have a good time? Yeah? Should we go and get Sissy? Yeah. Yeah. Um, Missy. We're going to go and get her. Who's going to get there first? I think it's you. Well done. So that's Scuba's, where Darcy is. Just opposite the kids club is the Sky Dome. Look at that. Okay, everyone is in good spirit, so we are going to go and watch the show. Are you excited for a show? Yeah. Never seen the hair is nice. It's not hair, it's my little microphone thing. No, it looks like hair though. It does, it does, a little fluffer on the top, it looks like hair, doesn't it? Should we go and see a fun show? Yeah. It has hair and it's a girl, isn't it? You think my camera's a girl? Yeah. What do you think my camera should be called? Oh, How I've never had a name for my vlog camera. Chloe. Chloe, yeah, what do you think the vlog camera Cassie. should be called? Uh, rainbow. Rainbow. Cassie camera. Okay, we'll have a vote. Who would like the camera to be called Cassie? And who would like the camera to be called Rainbow? Me! Me! I want you. Cassie Go and the watch camera. the show. We're going to headline theatres to see Twist and Pulse. I remember them being on. 
that Britain's Got Talent, and they were really good. We're at the bottom. Woo, it is busy. Good morning to you from another beautiful destination on the Nordic Fjords. I don't quite know how to pronounce it, so I don't want to get it wrong. Also, I was just talking up there, then a man came out on his balcony and looked down at me, and I suddenly felt really camera shy. <laughs> Good morning! <laughs> you would think, after 12 years, that I would be a bit cooler about vlogging, but I'm, I'm still not. Uh, but it's beautiful scenery. I'll perhaps just take you out and pan you around rather than doing full presenter mode. So this is where we are. I shall put the name on the screen and I will find out how to pronounce it and tell you a bit later. I just can't believe places like this exist. So gorgeous. Darcy thinks it's pronounced hella silt. Um, but I'm not entirely sure. So, we are just getting ourselves together. We're going to go off the ship now. We've had some breakfast, it was lovely. Let me turn you this way so it's better lighting. Um, and we saw at the window they have these beautiful like, waterfalls coming down this like craggy rock. So we're going to go and have a little look at that. Um, and later on we've got an excursion booked. So I don't know if we'll stay out and have lunch out or if we'll come back on the ship. I don't know, that's the nice thing about this. You're just like completely free to do what you want and see how the day takes you so come along with us. I'm going to try not to over film today because I feel like I had my camera out a lot yesterday. By the time you're watching this you'll know the length of this video but at the moment I have no idea. I think they're going to be chunkers. Um, all the best ones are. Mm -hmm. uh, so yeah let's go. So this is what it's like when you come off the ship. Look at the clouds all around the tops of the mountains there. And that over there is what we want to go and have a look at. Waterfall spritz. Oh, no. So you can see the ship there. 
and then that little bridge in sort of the middle ground that's where we were earlier we walked all up the side you can see it from this view it's just magnificent it's so so beautiful it blows my mind that something that big floats we're just walking back to the ship and one of the excursions is taking off i think that's called a rib a rib boat excursion rib <laughs> that's good <laughs> So we came back to the room after lunch to freshen up. We found that they have Downton Abbey on the TVs. Uh, and now we are gonna head back out onto shore because we have one of our piano cruises excursions. And I'm gonna take you along with us. It's a bit of a sightseeing. Um, hello. Hi, I wanna tell them my joke. Okay, tell them your joke. Okay, so why did the fish cross the fjord? I don't know, why did the fish cross the fjord? to get to the other tide. Way, that's a good one, that's a good one. Um, so it's sightseeing, um, I think there's gonna be some walking, I think there might be a bit of a coach, I don't know, we're just gonna go oh, and enjoy Jenny. it. I love coach. I didn't realize you were still in shot, there she is, right, let's turn the TV off and get going. This is the excursion that we are going on. I think this is our coach here. A bit windy. <laughs> oh look, there's a little river. I didn't even notice that there. There's camper vans there. Imagine waking up to all of that. Don't need to imagine it. I'm not good waking up to it. And then the bigger, the main branch that is the Stor Fjord. Anyway, now we are going Learning to uh, Nurangst Valley, Nurangst Dalian. But later when we come back, we are going to stop in another viewpoint. And from that viewpoint, we can see these uh, three fjords. Sunil's Fjord, Geiranger Fjord, and the main branch that is Stor Fjord. That is not a cafeteria or a restaurant, nothing like that. That is a hydroelectrical power plant. So as you see, uh, still, even if it's August, we still have patches of snow here in these valleys and uh, in, on top of the mountains as well, because the summer it's been quite cold. So we have stopped off at a beauty spot. I just wanted to show you this beautiful hotel. Look at that, it's like an ornament. I feel like it's just all the gorgeous details on it and that conservatory and the grounds. Beautiful. Let's have a little zoom in on this bad boy. Oh yeah. Quite a waterfall. Don't throw it any near anybody, Carl. Throw it here. Good Bye. job. Well done. Here we go, girls. Daddy's going to do one. I'm just throwing it as far as I can. Yes. Oh, yeah, that was a good one. That was a good one. Gorgeous. I am in the middle of the Norwegian fjords on a floating pier. There's nice people in the background We're like, it's not too bad, it's not too... <laughs> Just... <sighs> <Big gap. gasps> what? <laughs> this is very out of my comfort zone, but this is Cruise Louise for you. She's just trying things. She's just, she's just fearlessly adventuring. <sighs> Look at these brave girls doing a picture. You look sensational, girls. Oh, I love it. <laughs> no. Huh? No, don't, don't press. Oh. Oh. Say hello to Darcy Cam. Hi, Darcy Cam. <laughs> Come on, then, sweetie. Yeah. All the way up. Okay, let's watch. Ready, steady. Good job, good try, nearly. Here we go. I'll tell you what, these are the memories that I'll treasure forever. Just all of my family on a little beach in the Norwegian fjords, just skimming stones in the summer holidays. Like, this is it for me. This 
really doesn't get better than this Yay! for me. Oh, they were really emotional. <laughs> we are back on the ship. Liam has taken Pearl swimming and Darcy and I are just getting ready for this evening and feeling very snazzy. And we ordered a little snackette, if you will, from room service. I ordered a little portion of nachos. Let me just show you what a little portion of nachos looks like on Iona. So they delivered this box and I was thinking, oh no, they've they've got the order wrong, they've not they've not brought nachos. Um, hello. It's like a whole meal. This looks incredible. My only sadness is that it has taken me this long to discover room service nachos. Also, I thought it would be just something, a little a little afternoon nibbly thing. Um, and we've got dinner tonight at Sindhu, which is one of the restaurants here. Uh, so basically I'm going to have that and, and also dinner because, you know, <laughs> cruise life. So we are all just sat here. We've got about half an hour before our dinner reservation. Probably got some magazines. We're just watching the view. I think we might have a glass of fizz. I've raced outside onto this deck to see this waterfall, the Seven Sisters waterfall. Ooh. So this is Sindhu. So I have gone for the filled flatbread bites and Liam has gone for the lamb buna. Right, the girls are going to go to kids club for a little while and I have come back to the cabin because look at these views let me get this open oh my goodness look at these views the fjords have really opened up how beautiful oh my goodness i've got to stop saying how beautiful i'm going to research some new adjectives for tomorrow it gets delivered outside your door every night and it has all the information that you might need like tomorrow's dress code where you're going um and then all the stuff that is going on. Anyway, I'm gonna have a look at that uh, and then I think I might go for a drink with Liam and then we'll go and pick the girls up. But my battery is dying um, and I think I filmed quite a lot today. So I'm gonna put the camera down and I will see you tomorrow.